Hi everyone, this is Aya. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to make this fun slanted carrier box. So let's get started. I'm going to use Cottage Life Paper Collection by Graphic 45. This paper, you know, so beautiful. I'm going to flip through all the papers so you can see the beautiful designs and, you know, light colors. The die I'm going to use is by iCrafter and called Slanted Carrier Box. I'm going to write the name in the description box if you're interested. So I have here my manual die cutting machine, my magnetic platform, and I choose, you know, a solid background paper. For that large piece, you need, uh, or sorry, for that large shape, a uh, die shape, you need to cut two pieces because this is the main uh, box. So for the small shape die, you need to, to cut two pieces and for the tiny one, you need four uh, pieces. Now it's time to assemble the box. So you're going to fold all the creases. There is, you know, fold on the bottom, the top and the side. Now it's time to embellish uh, the box. I'm using here a uh, liquid adhesive. For the embellishment pieces, I use, you know, a busy background, you know, with the flowers. I made another box because while, you know, filming, the camera has stopped and I didn't notice. So I made another box. So after I laid out all the embellishment, now it's time to assemble the box. I added a liquid adhesive, you know, on the top and you want to make sure uh, that uh, the angle is aligned straight. Then you are going to fold the side up and apply adhesive on the other side. Now it's time to glue the bottom uh, part. So you see this part, I'm going to add a liquid adhesive in the back of it. Yes, in this area. So make sure it's straight. Hold it for a couple of seconds. then you would repeat the same thing for the other fold. Again, in this one, in this fold, I'm going to add the adhesive in the back, glue it down. And you wanna make sure it's also glued from inside so you can take any tool and make sure that everything is glued down. So now we have a square bottom. So when you push it down, it looks in. And that's how you make a, a locking part. Now let's continue adhering the other uh, parts. So you're going to glue that angle to the side of the box. Then you will do the same thing in the other side. Align the side to the box. Then next, adhere the top hand part. And 
Tada! You have a scented carrier box. So cool. So in the box, you can add anything. You can add, you know, some uh, spray inks, uh, Nouveau drops, uh, 3D paints, or a birthday, you can add M&M's bottle. You know, these long uh, bottles, um, maybe small perfume. It's so fun. It fits for any occasion. And the cool part I'm going to show you now that this box can fit in a two envelope. Push in the bottom, it's going to fold flat. Look, it's really flat. I'm going to fit a two envelope and you can return it back again as a box. Just push it, you know, down from the bottom and it's going to look in from inside. So this is really a fun uh, gift. You can give it to anyone. Then I die cut a tag and a word uh, for you. Maybe you can put happy birthday or, you know, any sentiment. So I hope you like this uh, video. Please give this video a thumbs up. And if you have any question, please leave it down below. Thank you so much for watching. See you later. Bye.